Iraq country profile. Capital, Baghdad. Population, 39,309,783. World region or continent, Middle East. Currency, New Iraqi Dinar, NID. Type of government, transitional democracy. Languages spoken, Arabic, Kurdish, official in Kurdish regions, Assyrian, Armenian. Religions, Muslim 97%, Shia 60% to 65%, Sunni 32% to 37%, Christian or other 3%. Major industries, petroleum, chemicals, textiles, leather, construction materials, food processing, fertilizer, metal fabrication slash processing. Agricultural products, wheat, barley, rice, vegetables, dates, cotton, cattle, sheep, poultry. The name Iraq has been used for over a thousand years. Some say the name comes from as far back as the Sumerian city of Uruk. The region of Iraq around the Tigris and Euphrates rivers has been known as Mesopotamia and was home to some of the oldest civilizations in history. In Arabic, the name Iraq means deeply rooted, well-watered, fertile. The name has been in use since before the 6th century. Iraq was under British rule for 17 years, and Ottoman rule for centuries. It gained independence from Britain on October 3, 1932. General Saddam Hussein became Iraqi president in 1979. He, Saddam Hussein, invaded Iran in 1980 and Kuwait in 1990. However, both the invasions were unsuccessful, only draining Iraq of its resources and burdening its economy. Saddam Hussein was hanged on December 30, 2006, for crimes against humanity. During the Iraq-Iran War in the 1980s, Saddam Hussein was an ally of the United States. The underground bunkers built for Saddam Hussein were said to be virtually indestructible, being able to resist a direct hit by a 2,000 kilo TNT bomb. And the bunkers were as deep as 90 meters under the ground. In the memory of Iraqi soldiers who died during the Iraq-Iran War, a monument, Al-Shahid Monument, was built in Baghdad. The bunker specially built for the fifth president of Iraq, Saddam Hussein, was not just a small space to hide during wartime. Moreover, it was equipped with amenities such as a swimming pool, a recreation room, a gourmet kitchen and nursery for Saddam Hussein's grandchildren. Iraq is also home to the world's first writing system and recorded history. The Tigris and Euphrates are the two major rivers of Iraq. These rivers contribute significantly toward making the land of Iraq very fertile. Mesopotamia, the region, which roughly corresponds to modern-day Iraq, also referred to as the land amidst the rivers. Between the Tigris and Euphrates rivers, is considered to be one of the cradles of civilization. Iraq has been home to indigenous Akkadian, Assyrian, Babylonian and Sumerian empires in its history. Iraq's oil reserves, aprox, 150 billion barrels, are the fifth largest in the world. Venezuela tops the charts with 298 billion barrels of oil. Shiite Muslims are in dominance in Iraq. Islamic traditions relate that Noah's Ark was built in the city of Kufa, which is in Iraq. The Ark was built by Prophet Noah. Baghdad served as the center of learning during the Islamic Golden Age, and was also the largest multicultural city of the Middle Ages. The country's first productive oil well was drilled in 1927 in Baba Dome. The Iraq War started on March 20, 2003. The invasion was supported by a coalition of 35 countries with the U.S., Great Britain and Australia playing major roles. Initially. Several precision bombs were dropped on the bunkers where Saddam Hussein was believed to be conducting meetings with senior staff. On April 4, U.S. forces took control of Baghdad's international airport. After much resistance and confrontation by Iraq, U.S. forces took control of Baghdad on April 9. By early 2007, at least 3,000 troops from the U.S. and several hundred soldiers from other coalition countries were killed. Saddam Hussein was captured by U.S. forces in December, 2003. The operation was named Operation Red Dawn. By December 2011, 
there were no U.S. troops in Iraq. President Bush's claim before going to war was that Iraq was making weapons of mass destruction, which could jeopardize the world's safety. However, no such evidence of manufacturing of weapons of mass destruction was found in Iraq. Thus, the president's claim became a major political debating point in the U.S. in 2004. Based on Arabic poetry, Maqam is the traditional music of Iraq. Reading of fortunes in the constellations and the fear of black cats were all invented in Iraq, as per archaeologist Leonard Woolley. Production of honey and its trade is a major industry in Iraq. Honey is known as a miracle cure in the country, and has the ability to treat headaches, arthritis and many other ailments. Multiple wars suffered by the country had a negative effect on this industry. The Epic of Gilgamesh is an epic poem from ancient Mesopotamia, Iraq. It is often regarded as the earliest surviving great work of literature, dating back to circa 2100 BC. Moskouf is a fish dish eaten all around Iraq and often referred to as the national dish of the country. The fish used to prepare Moskouf is usually freshwater carp, which is butterflied, marinated, set on skewers, then grilled next to an open fire. Tashrib is a term that may denote various dishes that consists of a bread topped with a different combination of ingredients. The base of the dish is made with Iraqi flatbread, and it usually comes topped with versatile stews that incorporate meat, chickpeas, beans, and various spices. Like, share and subscribe to Sitter's Lifestyle.